Good morning. Today is the 13th of September, Monday. Another day of introduction, introductory courses. Before we go to placement next week, it is currently 8.30. We have a one hour lecture on taking blood. And then after that, I have like a two hour break before I have my ACS, which is like clinical examination session, which is on examining the abdominals and then after that we have lunch and then we have ccs which is communication skills which i have to pre-read for during the break then i have another clinical supervision in the evening and then i'm going to the gym sessions on the court examinations in the abdomen super interesting um we're gonna do another one tomorrow and then on wednesday we'll actually do it in person so that we can practice the actual examinations so all i have left is our communication sessions later morning so it is tuesday i'm so tired yesterday after the gym i couldn't fall asleep so I had a bit of a lion today until like eight. And then I had a lecture at nine that I did not understand anything. It was about ECGs. So I'll probably have to go over that another time. And now I have a bit of a break because we have our ACS clinical examination session at 10, no, at 11.30. It's currently 10.30. I have to re go through all my emails again because I haven't been reading them and I think I'm missing out some stuff. Yeah, I still have to sort out my notion and sort out my life basically. So that's my plan for today. I have my clinical examination session later on and then we have a little bit of a break for lunch. And then we're in the hospitals finally for palliative care. So I actually need to pre-read for that. So I'm gonna do that now. Hello. Oops. I am back from the in-person session. It was a mess. I got absolutely drenched on the way there. Uh, thank God it didn't rain as hard on the way back. But I just got a package. It's my desk lamp. So this is it. I'll just be on my desk like this. So today is our first day of placement. So you split out in different hospitals around the area kind of and I am in Addenbrooke's for the next four weeks. So are you within Addenbrooke's is split up into like teaching heavy and teaching light. So I'm teaching heavy for the next two weeks. So we had a talk for what we did for the next two weeks and for these next two weeks I basically have teaching sessions, practical skills procedures, practice and all of that stuff. So it should be really interesting. Um, so we had our first session of CCS, which is communication skills. And we did, um, we practiced initiating the interview um, for history taking and stuff. That was fun. We did it with an actor and then we, they recorded us so that we can watch in our own time for some reason. But, it was super fun. So I just got back from there and I got some mail while I was there. So I got some lashes from AliExpress. And then, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So basically we um, had to pick up some stuff from the clinical school. So we got our clogs, which are low by crocs basically. So these are the shoes. And then a locker keys and oh, a USB and my ID card. Huh? Can you focus? Then last week I ordered some Crocs for some reason. So they just came today. So these are my Crocs. It's so cute. And they have some a fluffy bit in the middle to keep your feet warm. I wonder if it's removable. So 
I got Crocs. I don't have any other sessions this afternoon, so um, I need to go clothes shopping because I literally only have two shirts that I can wear to placement. I set up Notion this weekend. It's really cute. If you want a full Notion run through, then let me know in the comments. Okay, I'm gonna eat. Bye. Good morning. It is Tuesday. It is around 9 a.m. Today is our second day of core clinical methods and today we have a neurology seminar lecture thing and then we have a paediatric lecture and I have practical procedures in the afternoon where we'll practice venipuncture. puncture. It could be super fun. So that is what I'm doing today. I'm going to be in the clinical school until 5pm I think. It will be a long day. So now I'm just going to quickly get ready and do some pre-reading before my neurology. Hello, so I'm on my way to Christine's. So this morning we had um, a practice of the neurology examinations. Um, so we did upper limb and lower limb, and I practiced with a partner and then we swapped around. And then we were meant to have a lecture at two, but it got cancelled. So our next session is at three, so I just came home i was gonna go shopping i don't think there'll be enough time so i'll go tomorrow instead and so now i'm going to christine the key for company um yeah then we both have our clinical skills session later on which is on taking blood so we're gonna go back there after Hi guys, so I just got back from the clinical school this afternoon. We had a venipuncture procedural skills, so we practiced taking bloods. Um, we practiced on some mannequins and then we did humans. I was um, fed with my friend, um, but during my practice, it was fine on the mannequins, but then during my practice, I didn't put the needle deep enough, so it was like on just below the skin but wasn't like deep enough to actually collect the blood so that's my bed but we'll have lots more practice later um right now i have uh, like seven minutes until my clinical supervision where we're talking about how to present a patient i think and then straight after that i have spanish because as part of the clinical school there's language languages for medics as part of the clinical school there's languages for medics and I'm doing Spanish intermediate one for this year so that should be see what the but I need to quickly grab something to eat and then go set up my laptop yeah okay so Spanish is until 8 30 p.m. so I don't know when I will eat I'm just gonna grab my water and a quick snack Morning. So today is Monday, the twenty seventh of September, and it is my second week of CCM, which is core clinical medicine. So far, I've had two lectures: one on dermatology, and another one that's currently meant to be going on now, which is on pediatric respiratory. But I have to leave for the clinical school now because I have um, a practical procedure session. So I need to get there on time. So it's about 15 minutes until the end. The cycle is about eight minutes, but I don't want to be late. So I'm going to head off now. Yeah, I'll just take you along my day and the rest of my week. But my makeup came out so well. I hope the rain doesn't ruin it. Tea. Good morning. Today is Monday, the 5th of October, and it's my first day on wars. I'm super excited. Um, yeah, so basically, to, it is around one o'clock. I was basically in London for the whole weekend, so I spent the whole morning sorting out my room and tidying up, sorting out my life basically. 
Um, I'm just going to have breakfast and then I'm going to head to the clinical school so that we can meet our ward groups. So for the next two weeks I am in the university hospital and I'm in the colorectal wards. I specifically said that I don't want anything with smells so I think this is God. This is God trying to test me but um should be fun. Today I have my notebook and I'm hoping to do either one or two history takings. I don't really know which examination would make sense. Probably abdominal examinations but I haven't like properly learned it yet. So my plan for today is just history taking and I think I'll go over the examinations and hopefully my partner would have knows the examination so that she can help me go through it as well. Um, so I need to be there at 2.15 and then our session is meant to last until 6. But hopefully I can leave early if nothing's going on and then from 6 to 7 I have a subo. From 7.30 to 8.30 I have a meeting. So a really long day. I also need to go to the gym today because I procrastinated going there in the morning and I want to go to the gym four or five times a week so I can actually use my gym membership before I have to go to the regional hospitals because um, I don't know how whether I'll be traveling back and forth or just staying there um, yeah so I'm just gonna have a quick breakfast and then be off to the hospital hello so I've been back from the hospital for a while now straight after the hospital we finished around like 5 30 ish came back I had a super at 6 my wifi wasn't working major drama and then um so after the super I had a meeting for the Cambridge Black Medics Society and then I just had a quick dinner and now I'm so tired it is currently 9 and I set my bedtime for 11.30 and I actually have quite a bit to do but I'm so, actually so tired. I took a history with my partner and then we just shadowed some doctors in A&E and A&E like, and doing some examinations on some patients and then we had like a teaching session Ow. and then we had a teaching session with some F1s which was super helpful and it was super fun as well. Um, so but it's only day one so we'll see how it goes for the rest of the time oh I got my eyelashes done last week but I have to do my Spanish homework go over some of the conditions I looked at today I need to go over some anatomy so I know like what is actually going on um apart from that I need to download some ebooks for medicine so for the rest of the day I'm just doing Spanish and then planning and then revising so I never record it but see you later good morning guys it is Tuesday um it is around 11 o'clock um I have a teaching session at 12 10 so I need to leave my house at like 10 I like 11.50 so that teaching session is for one and a half hours and I have three hours of lectures from 2 to 5 then I have Spanish from I have Spanish from 6.30 to 8.30 but I have homework for that so I need to complete that as well so for the next 30-ish minutes I'm just going to probably start on some Spanish homework and then watch um, a video on what our teaching are going to be is MSK so that's like muscle skeletal I don't know what the case stands for but that should be really interesting it's with a consultant I think and so that is my day for today I'll take you through hopefully when I remember to record I don't know how much I'll be able to record today because it's kind of boring um, I'll see what I can record from the teaching session and the rest will just be online lectures in Spanish so if I'm doing something interesting I'll pick the camera up okay. <laughs>